hopefully this will work now because when we overhaul this at the workshop it produces already the voltage from the generator you know my friend this anemometer has a generator here here is the generator the generator produces easy here when I measure the voltage here I get uh, an easy output here inside of this uh, forward of this uh, airplane there is a motor here and also this one there's also a motor here actually the uh, others call this a servo motor but this is a this is a generator as big as this then the motor then the motor servo motor here you see this uh, slip ring produces easy easy output this this one and two terminal connected here to the slip ring that is a slip ring very very small uh, not exactly a carbon brass or a slip ring uh, usually when we talk about the slip ring there is a carbon brass but here no carbon brass it's just a brass itself then from there uh, transmit to this terminal the output of this generator from here we know that the, that uh, this working because we test this by uh, blowing with air here when this uh, move then it produces an output of EC voltage here one terminal one and two this uh, three four five six and seven terminal is for the wind direction the function of these two uh, servo motors uh, the other one is for the wind speed uh, wind speed indicator so that the, whenever the pilot goes came here and then they will, he will observe our anemometer then this uh, wind wind speed once once the air blow here it will generate a voltage so I think uh, no problem because it, it we measured an easy output here in terminal one and two now prior prior in our uh, overhaul of this anemometer we found that, that at this side there's a bushing bushing was stuck up that's why it's very hard to move like that but now no more uh, noise no more abnormal noise it's very smooth now because uh, was already overhauled and clean now we are here in the main mass to install this hopefully it will work out nothing uh, problem for the converter and other uh, accessories connect connected here as I said this is on the lower side mo servo motor this is for the wind uh, wind direction wind direction means uh, Four angle of the, the four angle of the earth. I, think. I mean, no, uh, uh, forward, stern side, left side, the port side, and the starboard side. This is the function of this uh, wind direction to determine where the air is going. But uh, definitely. There's no air going from south, north to south. <laughs> it's only from east, from east to west. So we, this, we are working in the ship. That's why I said there's no air in the north and south. Unlike maybe when we are working in the airplane, but we are in the ship. That's why I said we are only particular of the port side, starboard side, wind, and uh, forward and up. Or they call this forward and aster wind. Okay, so this is the function of the uh, wind direction mot motor or the servo motor. So we will now proceed. Okay. This is now our wiring connection. This wiring connection have uh, seven terminals. Now I will. Uh, this 
hopefully by God's grace it will work.